Sometimes AI filters can create something great. Sometimes it actually looks like a decent rendition of what it is supposed to be. In this instance, the nostalgia from PS2 graphics can be instantly evoked thanks to the use of image generators, as outlined by Wear a Damn Helmet, who popularized the trend back on the 21st of November 2023. Whilst Wear a Damn Helmet shares their creative process so that anyone can replicate the results, they say they were inspired by a post from Average Duration Ad on that same day. As it turns out, any inconsistencies normally seen in AI-generated imagery come off as a lot less uncanny when viewed from the lens of a PS2 graphics filter. And man, do they look good! Each generation on the internet makes their mark with video game aesthetics from their particular era. It started off with homages to pixel graphics, then PS1 slash Nintendo 64 era graphics, and now PS2 era graphics. All of these eras give rise to approximations of what video game designers felt were their best replications of real life, and with each generation came kids who thought everything looked so realistic. It's funny now to look back and see just how weird older graphics looked, but hey, there's certainly a bizarre beauty in these images and they possess undeniable charm. It's awesome to have the power to change anything into a PS2 version of itself with that strange, almost liminal quality to it, as there really is nothing else like it around. Naturally, everyone seems to want in on the process, and there are millions of PS2 rendered images floating around the internet. The cool thing is that there are tons of easy-to-follow tutorials out there providing step-by-step -step instructions on exactly how you can create your own. They're very easy to find, but be careful of any site that asks you to put in personal info like credit card details, as it might be trying to get onto the trend to scam people. That being said, the coolest thing about this is the ease of use to get a decent-looking product. Most people on the internet have some vague memory of what PlayStation 2 graphics looked like, and in a world where early 2000s aesthetics are dominating, it's great that video games have become a de facto style of expression. It just goes to show how widely video games have been accepted in society, far from their roots of being demonized as the makers of school shooters. In short, the PS2 filters becoming insanely popular have revealed strong demand from an international audience for video game aesthetics, as well as the fact that the PS2 era has hit its stride in terms of nostalgia, following pixel graphics and PS1 slash Nintendo 64 graphics. What meme would you guys like me to give a lesson in next? Let me know in the comments below. And remember, like and subscribe! <laughs>